this may be worth checking into a beam and making the Darkless or Bow decision anyway. Yeah, it's looking more and more likely. Um, I don't even know if I'll bother with the Hall of Blades. I guess it's not a terrible spot for us, but I uh, know I feel like I'm, unless I'm playing on a very specific character type, my brain is so biased against Hall of Blades. tell ya. Uh, Master Archer. Okay, let's let's see who is Master Archery more between you and I, friend. I mean, Uzumans will also be helping me, so it's probably not the most fair assessment if we're being completely honest with ourselves. Ooh, Acid Clouds. Acid Clouds and Acid Walls. Doesn't get much better than that. Holy moly. Well, I don't even really know what all we took out there. <laughs> it's hard to tell when you're just Ab spamming, and largely to uh, negative effects, seeing as how we're just constantly shooting at the elementals instead of the real problematic people in the room. In fact, you know let's take one step further down to try and get a few more of you wrapped up in this, shall we? Do, do, do if the, I wish the elementalist could just chill. Like, come at me, you know? I would like to face you. Mano y mano. Hand to hand. Um, how close are we to recharging? You'd think relatively close, seeing as how we've done a decent chunk of change on these sons of guns since tossing out the condenser vein. But on the flip side, it's also looking like there's still plenty to go, so maybe I've just lost my mind. I feel like I'm getting lulled into a false sense of security here because we eventually, or occasionally rather, come down to this relatively nasty level of health, but then it usually comes up before things get too bad. Oh, never mind. Call down dam damnation from multiple sources. Yikes. Um, I think I will use a blinking. And. Do -do -do. No, how did you find me? How did you know I came this way, you son of a gun? Get out of here. Scram. Honestly, actually, never mind. Come at me because I would very much like to kill you outside of the purview of all your friends. Yes. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Ah, uh, never mind. Shucks. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Okie dokie. Well, this has been interesting. Yeah, it seems like the chance for ranged weapons is probably low, not really worth it. Okay. Good to know. Okay, artifact ring. Come on. Cold resistance! Yes! <laughs> there is hope in this cold, dark world. Um, I mean, I'd probably rather have fire resistance. But anyway, I'm not, not looking this gift horse in the mouth. That's awesome. I'm very happy. Uh, let's change out this ring for the cold. Oh, wait a second. Oh, and then I want to change my armor back as well. Do, do I change just back into this? What's my AC difference like in those? Three, that's not too bad. But now I can at least swap between fire and cold resistance, so that's nice. That's, you know, something. And we have negativity resistance as well, which was in no way guaranteed for us, so how about that? Whoa, rude. Extremely rude use of damnation. Get the heck out of here. Um, wearing the ring. Another ring. This one not looking quite as fancy, unfortunately. But still pretty solid, don't get me wrong. And this should be starting to clear off. I feel like we've been here for an eternity, it feels, at times. It was like lending a hand in a Jivya run. Didn't even charge for it. Truly the greatest of gods. Besides Jivya, of course, sorry. Um... Please don't punish me, Jivya. I'm so sorry for my transgressions. I didn't mean it. Oh gosh, stop eating all my stuff. <laughs> so we got. Uh, I mean, it was basically guaranteed to happen. Not the end of the world. Let's hope there's some artifacts here that could save us. Not so much. Ooh, it is a fancy hat though. So it's gonna be yeah, another pondering hat. We've done gone down this road before. 
Uh, this time around, I don't think I'm going to be quite as stubborn as our Minotaur, and we're going to just leave that son of a gun for the moment. Uh, but at least we did slightly increase our ability to change our resistances to the appropriate ones. We can kind of use the one pip of fire resistance and resistance potions, I guess, if we run into uh, a large number of annoyed enemies. And otherwise, yeah, what, what the heck am I doing with my life? Probably no more longbows out there, right? Oh, never mind. Oh, because they were inaccessible. They're not eaten. Those ate well, and isn't that what really matters? True, true. You're not wrong. Um, okay. No, excuse me. Not for you. Bad jelly. Um, I think we're gonna go longbow, though. So I'm going to pick this up, and I want to brand that baby. Ooh, more flames. Hooray. Let's try that one more time. Heavy. Okay, this is what I wanted to check. So attacks once per turn, down to rating 72. That seems pretty worth it. Because that's irrespective of enemy resistances, because so many enemies do have resistances in Zot. And that will be very helpful for taking out, like, Orbs of Fire, per, for example. And it's still attacking once per turn. So I like that. And let's enchant this son of a gun to the nth degree, shall we? Do, do, do. Oh, right. Damage rating goes down a bit because I, I did lose my additional seven decks. Right. But still 69. Love to see it. And do, do, do. pick up my ring of flight. And I guess. No time like the present. Let's get the heck out of here, shall we? And away we go. Fantastic. Only have one magic mapping, unfortunately, so we can't do my usual strat of ensuring that we have as good of map knowledge as we possibly can over this section. That's fine. Um, what do I do with you? Probably just root ya. Root ya and shoot ya. Just as Jivia intended. Exactly, Connell's. Very nice. Um, but okay, I'm gonna shout for attention on this stairwell. Oh! The dream! Holy moly. Oh yeah, so see, look. Slime behind. I'm just gonna tab, and it doesn't fire through. Uh, maybe I hit, actually, so maybe that's not the best <laughs> representation, so ignore me. Uh, but heck yeah, look at that stairwell. Love to see it. Ooh. Ooh, and some more magic mapping. Don't mind if I do. I will get out of sight of that alarm trap. And let's bring you to me, friends. Um, in fact... Just the cheapest stair dancing of all time. Don't mind if I do. Only one person can ever follow us. Love it. You do have to stand in their clouds, I guess. Oh. And teleportation will uh, take put a quick stop to my, my cheesiness, but that's fine. I feel more energetic. Your dust and scales recede. Blah, blah, blah. Nothing too interesting there. We at least still have our willpower, and we still have our regeneration. So those are my two standards of living that I am adoring at the moment and would like to remain, if at all possible. But there we go. Yeah, definitely much better damage here with the heavy longbow. Love to see it. Not getting quite as lucky with my downstairs anymore. In fact, this seems like a floor where they're all going to be gathered together. I have no basis for this. Besides just pure random chance, but feel like it might be appropriate. Ah. Cloak at least goes up once in AC. I should keep checking as well anytime we kill something. See if we can get a cloak of repute here. That would be lovely. And still no downstairs besides the trapdoor, huh? Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Uh, okay, I'm in am in cold resistance mode. That's good to recollect. It makes sense because I was taking a weird amount of damage from our uh, 
fiery friend there as we were stuck in their cloud, so I was pretty sure that was the case, but nice to just guarantee it. And otherwise not too, too bad here. I should not stand in flames. That is bad, turns he bad. Um, and please, please just die. Please, no? One time? There we go. Heck yeah. Brother, and fortunately we now regenerate basically faster than the lightning golem can actually lay down the hurt, so that's fantastic. Dang, I was so hoping for uh, another ring of resistance of some sort here, but that's fine. Don't love the crystal wall <laughs> double zaps. Yeah, I'm definitely not as cognizant or aware of those incoming as I should be. Here, distant slurping noise, that's fine. And perfect. Now we do have two magic mapping, just enough to finish this off, so let us be a little more cautious and consistent over this last remaining bit here. Main issue is on the orb run up. If I run into trouble and have to read a teleport, that might get gross real fast. Hmm. Uh, let's definitely ooze a though. Just try to take out some of our combatant friends here in advance of them making their approach. Do, do, do. Not too shabby. And there we go. Finally regenerate back up to enough health that we can just fire away. Fire away. Beautiful. Um, nothing too world changing or altering in that loot pile, so I guess we'll just head around to this stairwell. And uh, to end it all off here, let's just put fighting on, let that max out to its heart's content. And yeah, actually, that's probably about it. Probably fairly happy with that approach. Oh, I should use all these enchant armors. Uh, don't enrage me, please. Yes. Perfect. Never care in the world. Maybe could have been slightly more careful or consistent there, since that seems to be, you know, what I keep going on and on about. But now uh, we're fine. Not a care in the world. Uh, okay, we do feed up. Jivio's just gurgling along there. Love to see it. And okay. Um, let us go into you. I want to inscribe you with at R2, maybe, and we can just burn through these. Oh, right, fire... I have leather armor fire resistance. I probably won't actually use this. Then I at least have some resistance in every category. That's as good as it gets. Okay. Um... Sure, I'll also put on my cloak. Ah, oh, never mind, max is plus two, so that was pointless. Um, but let's see... AC increases by one. We lose four decks. And we lose another one of our redundant electricity resistances. But we still have our crown, so that's fine. Yeah, I probably should have done that a lot sooner. But all is well that will hopefully end well. No promises yet. Still have a, a bit of a ways to go here. And this is where things always tend to get a little bit more interesting, to say the least. Hello, my cursed friend. Uh, ooh, we still have some ID potions, so I can definitely use that. Perfect. And not too shabby. What I'm tempted to do here... Oh, should I check to see if this stairwell is safe? I should check to see if this stairwell is safe. In fact, maybe I actually all do all of um, Zot or here to make sure even though i played this game so so many times still double checking that i have the right number for the floor that's fine uh but we might as well do this entire one just so that we have a bit more recourse on the escape path uh, specifically if i'm reading a teleport to get out of danger i would like to have it not be too bad of a, a leap from there to get to relative safety. Let's stop attacking summons, please. Oh, auto attack. I trusted you. You 
you're supposed to be the chosen one. Um, perfect. Well, that's just about it. A little bit of the area to go yet. Fantastic. And then we should be good, I guess, to take on the lungs and we'll see what fresh hell that may bring, as it as it usually is wont to do. Uh, we did go down to 67 attack with our crossbow, unfortunately. But such was necessary to just switch into slightly more consistent resistances, so not the end of the world. Um, yeah, actually, let's keep this hallway clogged up. Yikes. Ooh, double yikes. I guess 45 damage is a lot. Uh, one more hit should do it, though. Okay, good indicator of how scared we should be here, for sure. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Um, let's see, in terms of traps, both sides suck, but net trap is at least slightly more tenable, I believe. And no alarm traps in here. There are also no permanent teleport traps, which suck, because I do very much enjoy using those to get to safety. In fact, there seems to be a pretty huge lack in general for those sons of guns. Let's stand here for the moment, and we'll see how it goes as we run into our initial selection of new friends. Please don't step on the Zot Trap, though, if you could be so kind. That would be very cool and neat and nifty of you. Okay. We're doing things. At the very least... How much haste do I have now? I got up to six haste potions? Okay, I should probably use that. In fact, I should probably just play this as safe as humanly possible and burn through consumables at a pretty prodigious rate. I want to save some for the journey out, though. I guess that's the one potential factor in not just burning through until the ends of the earth. Uh, let's see, final... potentially final mutations. Rate of healing slows times two. You son of a gun. <laughs> natural camouflage skin hooray i guess it's something and there we go actually or should use a potion of resistance i should also phone a friend and by our powers combined i should be able to take care of you relatively fast i did see i took a mutation there not too sure at this point in time what exactly that is Ooh, nope i'm out goodbye um I was about to say that, but he's going to walk into that <laughs> trap for sure. And lo and behold, here we are. Oof. How long on this pig form do you think? I only have two cancellation potions, so I'd like to hold on to those if possible. Have I seen any messages saying that things are going to get better? No? Uh, can I read as a pig? That's nice. Okay, I'm going to read summoning. Now I'm just going to hide behind the wall of flesh. Go gadget summoning scroll oh jesus christ <laughs> that pig transport <laughs> transmutation lasts way longer than i thought so i'm glad we played it safe holy moly but okie dokie um as soon as i'm taking hits from multiple of these it's probably going to be a bit nasty but nothing we can't handle oh boy what I thought pigs weren't literate would show my prejudices. True, and they are smarter than dogs, as people are often saying. Oh gosh, alarm traps, alarm traps everywhere. Okay, that at least does something. I still have five potions of haste. Yeah, I'll use one. I need to take care of these sons of guns quickly and efficiently. Otherwise, we're potentially in trouble. Okie dokie. Well, that should just about do it, son of a gun. <laughs> ah! Watch darn it. Um, oh, Zod walls can't be... What the heck? Well, now I don't want to teleport because I don't know where it's going to take me, man. Oh, two orbs of fire? Why does your mom let you have two orbs of fire? Oh no, <laughs> it's gonna go downhill so fast. Um, okay, scroll of summoning. I get very little, but that's potentially okay. Let's back up here a smidge. Shucks. 
let's paste. Oh my gosh, another orb of oh no. Oh no. Don't mind me. I'm just going to chug health potions like it's my day job. Don't mind me. Excuse me, pardon me. Oh, the one orb of fire is so close to dead, though. I should probably try to do something about that. Let's see what kind of clouds I get. Okay, as long as I don't die taking a turn to do that. Oh, oh, okay. Next thing up, let's actually engage in some blinking action. And any day now, teleport. I know that teleports are delayed in Zot, but even with that, I expected it. Oh no, that's not going to do it. <laughs> oh no. Okay. What do we wish to do here? So I can chain a couple of blinks, and that should largely get me out of sight, at least potentially long enough to heal. I'm worried that I'm burning these when I don't need to, and they are kind of critical to our escape. Oh, the teleport hadn't? I'm so dumb. Why am I so dumb? <laughs> Gosh darn it. Boy, what a roller coaster. Um, okay. Well, we're in here now, so let's kill you first. I maybe should have focused down our casting friend here, because they are going to be a little bit of a problem child. But hopefully the mark trap, or the alarm trap rather, has taken most of our enemies away from this side of the, the lungs. And we'll have just a lovely easy stroll in. It's going to be so fun, nice, and cool. Never mind, that, that hurts. That hurts a lot. 73% chance to hit. Yeah, it was a blink trap earlier, exactly. Unfortunately, it was a little too late for me to notice that that was the case. Chances are I don't die in one hit here. Actually, especially with my regen, I don't believe I will, so that's perfect. Okay, please... Very quiet, everyone. Very sneaky, sneaky. Do, do, do. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, please teleport trap. Take me somewhere. <laughs> somewhere good is what I was just kind of saying to myself, but that's cool. That's very neat and fun and cool. Uh, what else can I do here? Because I probably should try to retain as much health as I can while waiting for that teleport to trigger. I was hoping if anything it took us into the left side, though I guess the left side has a different issue in trying to escape through a dispersal trap. Yikes. Otherwise, uh, potion of resistance will help. That's something. Then which of you is the greatest problem? You can't paralyze me at least, so that's nice. Mirror is interesting. Question is, do I mirror now? Or should I mirror, keep mirror around for Pan Lords? I think for now, I'm actually going to go other direction with that and box of beasts it. Holy, my, my beast is demolishing that orb of fire. Hell yeah, brother. Okay, uh, maybe the teleport wasn't strictly necessary, but still works out, I think, for the for the greater good. Um, especially with that silence coming in. Ah, and see, this is what I'm always afraid of. Okay, I can take a few hits just because of my health pool, and that's good enough for me. Heck yeah. Um, is this the right one? This is goodbye, friend. Ooh, me oh my. And away we go. Ah, uh, you I should kill. Then away we go. 
unfortunately, I kind of have to kill everything just because we're so slow. But we'll be fine. We'll be okay. That's cool and neat and totally okay. Yeah. One moment. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go with five. Uh Oh no, I'm dead. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh man. Oh, that happened so fast. Oh no. Oh no, not like this. Oh, I shouldn't have taken a sa I thought the teleport was much closer to pop it. Um yikes. Well, that's embarrassing. <laughs> Oh, good game though. What a character. What a character indeed. Nice flex don't you need to ascend. Exactly. Because at the end of the day, if we ascended on this character, that means no more Jivya for the rest of the series. And and what fun is that? Who could possibly want that? <laughs> oh, man. That was, yeah, very solid run. I should have waited one extra turn so that we proc the teleport as we came up. Again. I guess the hubris did eventually get us there because I thought for sure that we had another step in us. <laughs> oh me oh my. Well yes, it was a good run, Lady Bosh. Uh, we did finally, hey, we got a Naga Hunter off the, the ground. Hell yeah. It'd be cool to see melee Jivya. Oh, and for sure I'd normally go with the melee approach for a Jivya um, worshiper. Of course, Faded Altars just do be what fatal altars are so it is what it is but yeah regardless that was a really fun one i did enjoy it very powerful run across the board and yeah just about made it i mean put respect on seraph's name at the end of the day i mean i i always have but i think i kind of forgot it i lost my way for a moment but now oh boy was that the reminder uh to end all reminders so perfect <laughs> we'll uh definitely be ending it here Again, I had a, a really great time this evening. I hope you'll enjoy the run and the stream as well. Of course, we'll be back next week to jump into something else. I don't know. I'm kind of pulling names from a hat here in terms of what background species combos we're going for. So I never know. Um, I guess we could wait a little bit on melee since we did just do the Minotaur. I don't know. I'm not going to make any promises. If there's anything you'd like to see, definitely let me know. And I'm always happy to at least take that into account when trying to decide what, uh, what we're going to do the next time. And yeah, thanks again. Always a huge amount of appreciation for all of you folks, you know, chatting alongside us here, lurking in the background. Or hey, if you're watching this down the road through the VODs or on YouTube, and thanks to each and every one of you for joining us on the journey here. Uh, it's nice to see a couple of you YouTube kiddos come this way here today and say hello. So always like that. And yeah, I guess to end it off, as usual, we will do a quick check to see who is live at the moment. And we can send off a raid. I've been not having the best luck on this lately. Uh, but there were also a lot of holidays last couple of weeks in the the states at the very least which i think most of the streamers on my list are from oh gosh now laptop is just it's it's struggling it, she'll get there folks there it's trying its best no maybe everyone i love just stopped streaming is that the is that the case gosh well i hate to say it but here we are again and yeah, I guess if there's anyone that you folks would like to shout out, uh, shout out that would appreciate a raid, then definitely do so. If not, then as we've done the last couple of weeks here, I will just release you all amongst the, the general public without a concern for their, their safety whatsoever. So I guess proliferate and be happy. Do whatever you will. Uh, thank you again so much for dropping on by, for hanging out and all that good stuff always lovely to see you and yeah i guess that's that normally i feel like not raiding these days something feels like it's missing and so i have a harder time rolling through the, the end of the stream because so my brain keeps on being like no no i can't can't do the goodbye yet there's something else there's something i have to be missing but that's just my dumb brain being itself so one final goodbye to lady bash here you did your best kiddo and thanks again all of you for joining us regardless 
of our inability to <laughs> nail down a run that should have been an easy win. I do hope that you're having a great morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is for you out there. And I definitely hope to see you again soon, probably next Sunday when we'll be jumping back on. Just remember, folks, we never, even for a moment, even with a severe underestimation of Seraph's abilities, never didn't have it. I'll see ya.